Natalia Rodina spoke with experts about the bugs and what happens if you get stung. Uh, so, Natalia, they can be deadly, huh? Well, experts say that's not likely, but a sting from one of those caterpillars can be extremely painful and the effects can last for hours. So locals who recently experienced it for themselves want to warn others to beware of the venomous caterpillars. Great to look at, don't touch them. Looks can be deceiving, and these caterpillars know how to play the part. You're pretty much immobilized. A few days ago, Michael Dusk was working in his backyard in Spring Hill when he felt a sting and saw what looked like a ball of fur next to his foot. He says he was prepared for what was about to happen next. It's definitely incapacitating. Uh, it, it feels... Uh, extremely painful. They're known as puss caterpillars, one of the most venomous species found in the United States. The Florida Poison Control Center in Tampa Bay knows them all too well. Because of the way they look, they're very attractive. They call them puss caterpillars because it looks almost like a, a cat and it makes you want to touch them and see how soft they are, but they have some stinging hairs that the caterpillar uses as a way to protect itself. Although a sting can be debilitating, experts say a trip to the ER isn't normally necessary. If you call us right away and we can get the spines out, we can tell you things that you can do to relieve a lot of the pain. Those who've had close encounters want others to remain alert. Over in Riverview, Paula Laswell recently came across three of the fuzzy critters behind her home. Despite the temptation, she kept her distance. You just have to be aware that it's not a bug that you pick up and um, you should always uh, not pick up any caterpillars in Florida, but uh, I think that that's an unusual one that looks like you want to touch it. Now experts say Florida is home to several other venomous species of caterpillars, not just the pus caterpillars. So in order to avoid any painful experiences, it's best to resist touching them all together. Mark. Just another one of our critters in Florida that uh, we're always in awe of. Natalia, thanks very much.